in the mid 1980s UGC had started a new experiment that was to create centers of excellence in the university sector known as inter university centers uh, we got the first uh, set of buildings in 1991 and the main campus was completed in 1992 we have about 17 the faculty members at any given moment there are 30 research students and there are about 25 postdoctoral fellows between them uh, this very this pool of very talented people uh, are very productive they carry out excellent research in theoretical areas of astrophysics in cosmology and gravitation theory and also in observational areas and in making absolutely excellent astronomical instruments the research work which we do in ayuka spans a wide variety of topics both in theory and in observation in theoretical areas we cover almost all areas in astronomy and astrophysics in particular cosmology and general relativity is uh, one of the main thrust areas in addition there is quite a significant amount of activity in extra galactic astronomy high redshift universe structure formation in the universe and various other aspects of high energy astrophysics and the galaxies their dynamics and things of that sort in addition to this this theoretical research there is also a very active instrumentation work which goes on in this uh, institute they also take care of most of the issues related to our telescope the gravely telescope which is a 2 meter class telescope situated very close to pune uh, it actually provides a very stress free free atmosphere where one is able to work on anything that one wants especially so many areas of research are uh, pursued here which is very unique so while one learns on a specific subject one automatically broadens its mind to various other areas i for example come from a background of working in magnetic fields whereas after joining here i started working in the structure formation ayuka is a very dynamic vibrant place very student friendly and has frontier research collaborations with a lot of institutions all over the world it has world class library infrastructure facilities and i'm very happy to be with working in such a prestigious research institute in our country the administration is very helpful so because of which we do not have to run behind uh, administration tasks and this saves time for our research as far as atmosphere is concerned uh, there is a constant influx of people there are both world class experts as well as uh, young vibrant researchers and uh, because of this constant a uh, flux of people there are always new ideas new interactions and it's always helpful for our research one example i can give is from two people from two different universities one from north one from south they happen to come here they were working on similar problem so they decided to collaborate and they wrote a scientific paper which was published in a good journal now this sort of thing could not have been possible before a center like this were in existence so many of our visitors are also uh, from all over the world and they come here basically some of them come for various international conferences that are being held at ayuka and some of them are here because they are working collaborating closely with various faculty members of ayuka and so they spend also quite considerable amount of time and we kind of encourage uh, people to come and spend their time here they're quite happy because of all the facilities that they find here are comparable to anything else that they have ever experienced and they also form an interest important link for us with the outside world i have been an associate of this uh, center for more than 10 years and uh, i have been a frequent visitor here uh, i have found the atmosphere the facilities and the infrastructure as good as any in the country and outside the country this uh, ayuka is uh, has been a source of inspiration for the university sector particularly because i belong from the university and during my uh, phd student time i had been here and then i became a faculty so i know a very i have a good impression about ayuka we come from a very distant place you know that we are from the kashmir but if we come we feel it like a home so ayuka has been able to provide a good pilot farm to the people doing astrophysics in different units. so now you find in the university sector there are quite a few people using uh, real data 
and making models and various other theories and so forth. So, Ayuka is a major player in the world virtual observatory movement, which uh, makes all the astronomical data available anywhere in the world uh, to the entire uh, Indian and the international community. So, a person sitting in Assam or in Kerala or in Madhya Pradesh has exactly the same access to the data, providing he or she can access the internet as the best astronomers in the world. Now, uh, we produce a great many research papers. Uh, we have fabulous observations. We have a 2 meter telescope which is located about 100 kilometers from Ayuka. And we are partners in the Southern African Large Telescope. And we also have access to many other such observing instruments. Then Ayuka is a participant in very important big projects like AstroSat, uh, which is the first uh, Indian astronomy satellite which will go in orbit next year. Ayuka is also a partner um, in the LIGO uh, gravity wave detector project, uh, which will set up a very large and very sensitive detector somewhere in India uh, in collaboration with uh, the American LIGO project. Then Ayuka is an important partner in the national effort uh, to join the 30 meter telescope project, which is an international consortium uh, which has come together to set up one of the world's largest optical telescopes which will be located in Hawaii. So through all these efforts, Ayuka has immense uh, access to the world's best observing facilities, uh, which will help not only scientists in Ayuka, but all over the country to carry out world class observations. Many facilities of Ayuka, including the telescopes, as well as the high performance computing center uh, and the marvelous library that we have created are all used by the visitors from the universities and from colleges in their own research. In that sense, Ayuka has lived up to the mandate uh, which was given to it at the time of its creation uh, 25 years ago. This is our mission statement. Ki bacho ki aankho ki chamak jagao. For instance, this is the, it's an amazingly simple motor to make. It takes less than 10 minutes for a child to make a motor like this. And the battery is about 20 rupees, otherwise it just costs 5 rupees to make a motor like this. If children make a motor like this, they will be hooked to science for life. Everyone in their childhood is interested in astronomy, but that interest wanes as they grow older, primarily because they do not see facilities which are available for research. But with all the new facilities becoming available, we expect to attract more and more young persons to the science, uh, which will help inculcate not only uh, astronomy itself in the public mind, but also the scientific approach and scientific thought in general. Many of these projects involve very complex engineering and uh, also uh, they involve interaction between the universities, the research institutes and the industry, uh, which makes uh, our country expert in all sorts of complex methodologies and processes and prepares us better to address the modern times.